Hello and welcome to your Astrological Vibrations for Tuesday, September 16th, 2014 by Gaia Blooming. Our energy mantra for today is, as I purify my life, I find my equilibrium. And today we have some great things for purification. So Sun still in Virgo. We're in our last few days, last basically week of Sun in Virgo. So we're concentrating on purification. And today the purification may fall a little bit in the house range. <laughs> we have um, the moon moving into Cancer in the morning. And so Cancer is always, you know, takes us to our home. We feel, feel safe. We have our sanctuary. And so today may be a great day. You have some time. Just pick a few things to clean up, clear out, release, get rid of, share, um, move on, purify your space to help you find your balance. We're going to be working towards balance because we're going to be working towards sun shifting into Libra soon. So balance is going to be, you know, start becoming a theme. We have Venus today at the Uranus degree in Virgo. And so this again, you know, can lend itself to purification of your house. Uranus is always about shifting. Uranus loves it when you can let go of things, release attachment. Um, so having Venus there, you know, this may be physical in nature. This may be relationships in your life. You may struggle with your relationships. But I think if you can take it, like, okay, bring it back to me. How can I shift my environment right now? Maybe a little feng shui is in order. <laughs> I just... I just did that. I add ing to feng shui, but, you know, that happens. Also, connecting to that 13-degree uh, that, uh, Venus, we also have Lilith and Jupiter conjunct. Jupiter is at 13 degrees. Lilith is still at 14 in Leo. And that is squaring our Ceres, which is kind of the mothering energy, also at 13 degrees. So this is kind of a lot of Uranus energy. So the shift energy is really big today. So again, letting go of things today is going to be great practice for you. Um, but I was always looking at this, I was like, wow, that energy kind of feels like a cosmic game of mother may I. So you may feel like, I don't know, as you're going through your stuff, I had a cancer, or I have a cancer mom, and it's always been hard for her to let go of things. She was born, yeah, Mahalo agrees, <laughs> she was born um, in the Depression era. And so, you know, everything they had to hang on to, not to mention she's a cancer. And so it's been a process my life to learn, if that was her process, my process is to learn to let go. So not to hold on to every little doodad that I'm like, ooh, ooh, I love this be able to let it go, pass it on, and you don't have to ask your mother's permission. Look at your inner intelligence, look to spirit's intelligence. Um, let's see, we also have the moon connecting into Neptune this evening, which is definitely going to bring, you know, your intuition's going to be strong, your dreams are going to be strong. And I want to mention, speaking of your dreams, um, we have Mercury conjunct North Node in Libra. And Mercury is in the shadow period, so we're starting to move within with this. And with the North Node there, I think if you're having questions about your destiny and where you want to go in your life, maybe setting intentions this evening with the Moon and, you know, intuitive Cancer, connecting into Neptune, which is retrograde, you know, again, taking us deep within our own wisdom, and then this North Node energy with Mercury. Tonight may be a great night to get answers. So invite those answers into your life. If you need clarity with something, clarity in your destiny in some regard, ask. All right, and so our card for today is Diptotes, inviting. And it says, as we choose awareness, we observe, we listen, we know we are not alone. We do not always know the language of every other consciousness. We extend an open heart. We invite all that there is. And this is to invite a reality of unlimitedness. Welcome all. So have a beautiful Tuesday. I'll see you tomorrow. Namaste.